That's exactly right, Mary. And you know, Royals fans, they don't mind at all. The Mets will have to see all of the World Series jerseys, hats, banners in the stands. They're also going to see a World Series banner race tonight. That happens about 7 o'clock. And I'm sure Royals fans uh, don't mind giving it to the New York squad twice. That'll be good stuff. Other stuff happening tonight as we are about two hours away from the opening pitch tonight. Tonight's Star Spangled Banner will have an alternative flavor. The band American Authors will perform the national anthem before the game. They'll also be in concert at Prohibition Hall Monday night. The Kansas City Symphony will perform the Star Spangled Banner before Tuesday's game. And on Tuesday's game, that's when it's bling bling time, folks. The rings will be here. The Royals will pass out the World Series rings before Tuesday's game again against the Mets. Fitting. The team got it uh, in spring training. They all got fitted, so they are ready to go. And if you're wondering why they moved them or they switched them around, well, they didn't do them all tonight because tonight's game is a national game, of course, on ESPN. The ring ceremony will take place on Fox Sports, so uh, everybody at home will get to see that game. So that'll be good stuff. Now, we talked about first pitch. That's coming your way at about uh, two hours from now, but the first pitch really started about eight hours ago at Union Station called Relay the Way. What happened? A whole bunch of folks lined up and played catch from Union Station all the way here to the K for a great cause to raise money. Fox 4's Kerry Wickersham has more. 